This was truly the first national center for homeland security that was ever started in the country. Congress was very forthcoming in supporting the centers of excellence. They understood how critically important utilization of our universities are to winning the war on terror. The 9-11 Commission report, one thing it really highlights is that where our government failed was the ability to imagine, the ability to anticipate what terrorists might do. The academic community needs to be involved in terrorism-related issues. Uh, they have a lot of good ideas, and particularly a lot of ideas that are beyond the bounds of, sort of traditional security studies. CREATE basically does three things. Our main mission is to do research in risk and economic sciences. We also have an educational mission. And finally, we have a very vigorous outreach program. Our research focuses on three main areas. In risk assessment, we're trying to answer the question, what is the risk of terrorism? Trying to solve terrorism or mitigate the effects of terrorism is an open-ended question and it's very difficult to solve so that kind of puts everyone on a level playing field. In economic assessment we ask ourselves what are the long-range economic impacts of these attacks. Probably the most important way that we are involved is through our urban economists and regional economists who do economic modeling of the impact of uh, changes in the economy. A good example would be a study I did on what would happen if a terrorist were to knock out the electric power system of Los Angeles for two weeks. And then risk management, we ask ourselves, what can we do to reduce the risk of terror? This is where CREATE is worth its weight in gold. Because as a center of excellence, as a university, able to leverage all of the cutting edge technologies, approaches, and underlying philosophy of how we do risk-based analysis, which is a new field. It's cutting edge. It's exciting. CREATE has expanded tremendously. We have new partnerships, a larger staff, more projects. And it is my understanding that the CREATE Center is funded through 2010.